been a crisis season for Arsenal so far. Anai Emery, despite assembling a formidable squad with some of the best players in the country, is battling for his job. The weekend's 2-0 defeat to Leicester surprised nobody. The Foxes are flying high and the Gunners appear to have ran out of ammo. They're looking up to Brendan Rodgers' side, something that was once unfathomable. There have been conflicting reports about Arsenal's stance on Emery. Some say he's got the job until the end of the campaign. Others have suggested that his head will roll in February, with the busy Christmas and New Year schedules primed to decide his fate. Stanley has backed Emery. He went public this week, saying, We are as disappointed as everyone else with both our results and performances at this stage of the season. We share the frustration with our fans, and I, players and all out staff as they are not at the level we want or expect. Things need to improve to meet our objectives for the season, and we firmly believe Anai is the right man for the job, together with the backroom team we have in place. We are all working intensively behind the scenes to turn things around are confident we will. We never take our fantastic support for granted. We hope we can all stick together and get behind the team in this challenging period, as together we are stronger. Arsenal are determined to come across as united, particularly at a time where the fans are turning on them. But the Daily Mail say that Stanley is prepared to pull the trigger, but only should their dire form continue. If Arsenal fail to convince, but pick up some crucial points, then Emery has more chance of seeing out the season. But it appears Stanley is tougher than he's come across so far. He will get rid of his manager if it means putting the team first. Emmanuel Petty believes the Arsenal chief's previous words about backing Emery are merely political. He told Paddy Power, what the club came out and said about Emery's job being safe is not true at all. Everyone knows this the typical official language clubs send out to the press and fans when things are not going well, when they sense tension. This is, a political answer and most of the time when I hear officials or shareholders talk like this it's proof for me that they're already thinking about sacking the manager. It's the opposite of what they're saying that might be true. Regarding replacements, there's currently no favorite. Both Jose Mourinho and Massimiliano Allegri are out of work but may not be suitable for the North London Giants. Links to the likes of Mikel Arteta, Eddie Howe and Freddie Youngberry have also surfaced in recent times. Let's block ads.